you, David. Tidying up a neighborhood is a group effort. Some homeowners on Washington Avenue, though, in Evansville, feel like their voice is not being heard as more and more light poles are becoming damaged. Eyewitness News Amelia Young is live there now and spoke with neighbors about the problem. Amelia? You may not notice it at first glance driving down Washington Avenue, but for folks who live here, it's becoming an eyesore. Several damaged light poles line the streets, just like this one. It was hit just a few weeks ago and is now starting to tip over. And neighbors here are becoming concerned for other safety. The safety issue it is an eyesore. Tony Bell has walked up and down Washington Avenue a lot. When we moved here for 19 years now, the, the neighborhood was really bad. Over the course of time, everybody started taking pride in the neighborhood and started cleaning it up. But recently, I hear a uh, loud crash and I look and a car had hit it. More and more light poles on the street are being hit, leaving dents and bigger issues. A light pole in front of his home hit just a few weeks ago. The only reason this pole is still up from the damage is because of the wire. The light pole now leaning towards the street. When you have something like this happens, then you sit here and deal with it. And you can't get anything done. Bell says he has called Vectrin, but never heard back. And the other part of it is, is that if we get a wind, okay, then it could blow over and it could hit a car or hit somebody. You know, and, and that's the biggest issue is, is that it is unsafe. He's done a lot over the past two decades to keep the area clean and hopes this isn't the start to the neighborhood reverting back to old ways. We got a long ways to go, but everybody has to get involved. And I just got off the phone with Vector officials. And good news, I'm told that this poll will be replaced on Monday after an investigation. They said that it wasn't at risk for falling, so it was not removed immediately. And as for the other polls on Washington Avenue that are dented, Vector says as long as they are not a safety concern, they will remain in place. Live in Evansville, Amelia Young, Eyewitness News.